Hey, it's Suffering Student here, and today we're going to be talking about the hierarchy in JavaFX. And it's just going to be a short video explaining the basics to get the basic understanding of the hierarchy when we create some kind of uh, a GUI element in JavaFX. So it's built from first a stage, which is passed to us through the start method, which we are overriding from the abstract class application. And this stage, we can do like set a title, then we can set a scene, which is the next part. So first we have a stage, which can contain a scene. And then this scene contains some kind of parent, which we really would call root, because it's kind of like when you look at a tree, but like the crown and the roots, which contains a lot of information. But so we've got the stage, which contains a scene, which contains a parent, which in this case contains our FXML document, which means it contains all, all our GUI elements. So that's like the basic build of a of a JavaFX project. But let's take a look inside scene builder. So we could actually demonstrate. We, we would normally not do it because we already, as we saw inside uh, IntelliJ, we already have our stage and our scene. So we just need some kind of information on this scene. In scene builder, we could actually create a stage. And as we can see, this stage contains a scene. And we can't do anything with the scene. We can change the, we can set a title, just like we did in here. Stage, set title. And we got the scene, which can have a color or some kind of style sheet, but that's not what we're going to be looking at for now. And then this scene contains an anchor pane, which allow us to put any kind of elements inside this anchor pane. We can't put any elements inside a stage or scene, but we do it on the anchor pane. And in the next video, we're probably going to be talking about different kind of panes and what it actually means. So we can have a stage, which contains a scene, which contains a pane, which means somewhere we can put some kind of element, control, the control element. We can, we can control through our controller inside our IntelliJ. So that's just basically very, very good to have this basic understanding of having a, a stage, which contains a scene, which contains the FXML document, which is all our stuff, like in this case, it is our anchor pane. And that's the basic setup, and hope you enjoyed. See you in the next video.